I'm Amy Summers. I'm the program coordinator for Raising Hope. Um, our mentees are anyone who feels like she needs somebody in her life to lift her up and to believe in her. Um, usually the demographic are people who are lower income, but it doesn't have to be. Um, sometimes people don't have family or friends or just somebody that believes in them in their court um, around here, so to speak. Um, they often come through agencies, referral. Maybe she wants to go back to college, but she's afraid because she's the first time in her family somebody's going to college. So we'll match her with a mentor who can get her into Ulster Community College. Maybe even they have a program over there that supports first time um, college goers. Maybe they're an entrepreneur who just has a lot of really great ideas but no business acumen. They also need to be free of domestic violence and alcohol and drug dependence for at least six months. Um, they can be any age. Mentors are, um, as, I, as I mentioned earlier, they're women who have a sincere desire to help another woman. woman. Um, oftentimes they feel like they want to pay it forward. Maybe they too have had challenges in their life. Maybe they come from um, an atmosphere where they face some form of domestic violence or they poverty or they didn't have somebody that believed in them or maybe they did and they had a mentor and they know the value of mentorship. We do a mentor training and then we have a weekly supervision that you can call or email us anytime if you have something that you're just not sure you want to run by us. What I'm getting out of it is uh, the real need that I feel women uh, need to have other women partner with other women for their strength, you know, to have, you know, somebody who's just like, okay, you want to take this slow or you want to do this. And it's just at a pace of, you know, it's not about trying to get like the best job or, you know, it's more about trying to fit what's going on in my brain. What have I not had a chance to finish doing or want to do and still also work with the life that's existing right now. When I meet with her once a week or even make contact with her, it kind of keeps me on track. So there's like the mental side and emotional, and then there's also, you know, your dreams and keeping those dreams on track. Um, I, I've always tried to be involved in volunteer organizations, and I became interested in this one when I learned about it, and I ended up going to a few meetings to see exactly what the programs were about and to meet some of the mentees as well as some of the other mentors. I've got a more non-traditional employment background. I've been self-employed. So I didn't have the traditional sort of corporate skills or you know knowledge or experience um, that I thought was necessary for mentoring, but the mentors were really clear you know, how much you can contribute in so many different ways. And it was really appealing. And I, I really enjoy it. It keeps me, yeah, it does. It keeps me connected with what's going on in the community. Sasha's younger than I am, so it also keeps me abreast of work changes that are going on, employment changes. It's nice having somebody to work on something with and you know, so you can sort of start to see product, um, progress.